So I've been eating at Blue for a week now, and today I'm gonna tell you everything you need to know about it. Blue Restaurant on Celebrity Cruises is known for its contemporary atmosphere and upscale cuisine. Located on the ship's lower levels, the restaurant offers a quieter, more intimate dining experience, perfect for those looking to escape the hustle and bustle of the ship's main dining room. The restaurant is only available to the Aqua Class guests and serves just a few hundred people per cruise. You have to book an Aqua Class room if you want to eat here, which is what I had to do in order to bring you this video. I spent an entire week on the beautiful Celebrity Beyond. Our blue was located on deck 5, just before Eden Restaurant, and also offered a nice view of the ocean if you got a window table. I will link some videos for you up top if you wanted more details about that trip, the Aqua Class perks, the private backstage kitchen tours, and a lot more. Make sure to subscribe, I have so much planned for you, you do not want to miss out. The menu at Blue Restaurant is focused on healthy, contemporary cuisine with an emphasis on fresh seafood, premium meats, and vegetables. Guests have praised the restaurant for its inventive dishes such as the truffle mushroom risotto and the roasted black cod with miso glaze. The restaurant also offers a variety of vegetarian and gluten-free options, making it a great choice for those with dietary restrictions. It serves breakfast and dinner only. It's important to note that you will be on your own for lunch, unlike Lumine, which is a sweets-only restaurant for retreat guests Blue does not serve lunch. I have to say I found that to be very disappointing, so keep that in mind. Breakfast at Blue, however, is fantastic. You get a very good menu that consists of eggs any way you like it, benedicts, omelets, frittatas, parfaits, fresh fruit, cheese plates, smoked salmon, freshly baked goods like croissants, danishes, as well as French toast, pancakes with a side of bacon, sausage, mushroom, ham, and so much more. One of my favorite parts of breakfast are the freshly squeezed juices. Not only do you get orange, grapefruit, cranberry, prune, or apple juice, you can also get juice smoothies. They consist of a combination of juices and milk or yogurt to basically create the most delicious thing ever. My favorite was the Blue Berry Blast. That was pomegranate juice with wild berry yogurt. It was godly. I loved it and you will as well. Overall, Breakfast at Blue is an 8 or a 9 out of 10, depending on how picky you are. Quality, presentation, and taste is very good. I'm taking one point off for personal preference. It's a bit too healthy for me. For example, no hash browns at all. Certain things are completely omitted from the menu. I mean, I understand the focus here is healthy, but offering hash browns maybe some other things as well on the side would have definitely brought it home for me so i'll deduct the point otherwise it's consistently a few notches above the free breakfast options on the ship dinner at blue is also very good think of this as a premium dining room that focuses on healthy cooking the menu changes every night it consists of five sections signature cocktails that are only offered at blue clean cuisine section, which usually has plant-based burger, a vegetarian dish, and two fish dishes that are changed daily. The menu, the main menu, consists of six or more appetizers usually, four to five main dishes, and three to four desserts that are changed daily. The desserts rotate as well. They have ice creams, sorbets, and so on. The soups and salads are kind of sprinkled in between the appetizers and the main dishes with the main selection usually consisting of a pasta, a meat, a chicken, sometimes a duck, a salad, and usually some sort of a fish. All of the dishes were premium cuts with ingredients that were paired really well. The formal night dinners were elevated with the last formal night being the lobster, filet mignon, and baked Alaska night. This is like similar to the main dining room, but cooked in the blue way, although the baked Alaska was of course the same. All of the dishes at Blue are cooked in a healthy style. Most of the dishes feature a protein and a vegetable with a small side of starch only when needed. 
There was a general lack of cheese in any dish and I noticed that the sauces were not very heavy. Overall this created a meal that left you satisfied but not super heavy and bloated. While generally this is a good thing, I feel like it was a bit extreme here. Some of the dishes could have been better if they did not have so many vegetables or if they featured a little bit of a heavier sauce or maybe a little bit more potatoes and so on. Keep in mind I like veggies but there's only so many green peas and corn you can stick into my meal. It was a little bit too much so I'll take one point off for that. I also noticed a bit of inconsistency between the dishes. For example, on lobster night, my lobster was half the size of uh, Melissa's. And some of the other sides were a bit inconsistent when it comes to plating as well. Now I will not take any points off for this because I feel like this could have been an oversight, but that was definitely noticed. Overall, Dinner at Blue would rate an 8 out of 10 or higher depending on how picky you are. Desserts at Blue came in three parts, a rotating section with three desserts that were changed daily, one of them usually a sugar-free option, several ice creams and sorbets, and a classic dessert section with a variety of cheesecakes and chocolate options. Overall the desserts rated maybe a 7 out of 10 on average, some were pretty good, others were just okay, overall nothing to write home about here. Average with a twist of fruit, I would say, kind of just okay. In terms of service, many guests have noted that the staff at Blue Restaurant is attentive and friendly, providing an overall enjoyable dining experience. I very much agree with this. Service at Blue is excellent. They will remember your name, what you drink, where you like to sit, and do whatever to make you feel very special. And that's really where this place shines. It's that personal attention and extra service that goes a long way on a massive cruise ship. You never have to wait for a table or feel like you're just a number that's part of a big crowd. Blue is a small kitchen that caters to only a few hundred guests. Each of them is special and is treated accordingly. Overall, Blue Restaurant on Celebrity Cruises is a great choice for those looking for an upscale dining experience with a focus on healthy contemporary cuisine. It's one of the best perks of the Aqua class. While it may come at an additional cost, I found the food, service, and the convenience to be well worth it, something I would definitely recommend if you can afford it. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one.